Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to download and install Chromium Web Browser on Windows PC. But before we start, hurry up and check out these offers just under this video. Let's get started. So how do you exactly download and install Chromium Web Browser here? Well, first things first is you want to open up any browser that you currently have right now on your PC. So usually you'll have Microsoft Edge default, uh, default installed default in your uh, PC. But yeah. So first is you want to search for a very specific keyword here, which in this case is going to be Chrome Download Chromium App Spot. Now from here, it should give you different links here, but we want to look for the very first one here. Let's go ahead and click on it. And from here, you want to go and click on Download Chromium. And it's going to download Chromium zip file here. So this might take a while, so just wait for it to fully download. But once it's actually downloaded, let's go open up the folder where it's actually downloaded. And you want to go ahead and basically access a few things here so first is you want to go and double click on the zip file and you want to go and extract that file into your desktop or in this case in whatever location you want to store this so in this case you may want to install this on your documents folder anywhere that is uh, quite safe for you to store but uh, yeah so it actually depends on where you want to organize that but once it's actually extracted here we should be able to access the files inside of it but inside the files what you need to do is don't want to go and double click on it and you should see chrome.exe here you just need to double click on it and it's going to say windows protected your pc let's go and click on more info here click on run anyway and it should run chromium here as you can see we are now using it so in this case, you can go ahead and start using it in whatever way you want. And by the way, you can actually right click on Chrome here, right click on it, and you want to go ahead and basically create a shortcut for it. Let's go ahead and choose show more options. And you should see the option here that says, so look for it. So it's going to be send to. You could go ahead and just choose the option for uh, creating a desktop shortcut. So just choose again, you want to go ahead and just choose. Uh, send to you want to just choose desktop and should create a dot xa you can just double click it every time in order if or if you want to access it but yeah so in this case that's about it so if you found this video helpful hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video